So in this video, I'm gonna show you how to um, fix your Roomba side brush motor. If it's like spinning really fast, no, if it's like not spinning or if it just moves for like a second. Yeah, that's what mine's doing. So you can see on here it does not work. So what you would need is a, sc a screwdriver and a new gear. I need this gear. You can probably get two gears because their teeth might be broken, but, and also the motor. I'm gonna show you how to get the, that motor out. First, what you're gonna do is pop out the dustbin, and this is um, for Roomba E series, I and S and J series. So you just pull out the dustbin, put that aside, and you're gonna flip it over. You have one, two, three, four, five screws holding the cover, and six is the side brush. So, um, like that. And you can see that this will have the battery. You'll have this little thing here, but this is where my cousin broke it. And it's cracked, so you gotta like pull it out. But that's the battery. So now what you're gonna see on the motor is there's two screws, one, two. So you can see in here there's one, two screws. Um, this one, I, I built this motor myself, so it's a little, oh my gosh. So you can see, so it should, the motor, it's not screwed in. And now what you're gonna see one screw here, you can see there's one screw. So you're gonna unscrew that, and there we have it. So we have one gear. So you can put your gear in. A little hard to sometimes get on when you have it. Works. So it's not spinning that. If your Roomba is getting the same problem, this is how to solve it. So there's two screws here. One, two, but I already unscrewed them. So when you unscrew these two screws, this should pop off. So then you can replace this motor. So you can just get a new one. And this is how you put all of this stuff back together. It's really, really simple. So you're gonna put in your motor. Screw in your two screws, I don't have them. What's the easiest thing to do is to put this, this in now, and then put the battery back in, and you should see this. So that's the side brush, we're gonna do that at the end. So it means that it's activating, activating. So I need it to activate, because I don't want it to bother me. So I need it to activate. Let's see when we turn this on. Because I'm a little curious about this. Here. S spins, but not that fast. I'm still a little curious. I'm gonna, instead of um taking the stuff out, I'm gonna actually unscrew this. I'm gonna put it in here. Ta-da. Let's see. If you like take the wheel out, that can be a little easier. So now I can see in there. Let's see if it's still doing that. Nope. Really simple. I don't want to screw it in too tight because if I probably do that, the, the plastic will probably hit it or something. So I don't want to screw it in too tight. Plus I don't want to strip it. Okay, cover. Actually my first Roomba that was the newer one that had like the newer brushes on it and the newer vacuum bin. Yeah, my cousin loves green, but he just doesn't like the dark green. But I don't care. You ought to hit the Let's hit the spot, let's see. And what? Uh, I, I put it back in right, so it's not spinning well. Again, I took it apart. I'm trying to see what the problem is. If it's the robot itself. So it looks like that's 
how it will sit in there. I don't see any broken things. So I can like spin it fast. Fine. But I probably have to. Here, let me put this back on. Oh my gosh. Cause like, if like, I see in here, the gears they're fine. I do this all the time. And see it bend together. If we put this in, side brush in, it's gonna spin. Other way, it likes to like be hard. So I don't get it. Cause I am tired of it being broken. Cause I used to like do this. I'm gonna try to. Oh, room is getting old. Oh my gosh. Let's go. A few inches later. All right, so I'm back. So let's turn off this Roomba. I am so happy that I can work. So first it was, I just had to take the gear out, put a new gear. Second, it, it was really stuck. Third, then I had to, see. So that is how you fix a Roomba Cybers module in your E series, I series, and S series and J series. No, it's not the S series actually. It's only I and J because the S it's a little different. Really simple. This is my E series, my E5. I'm probably gonna do a video of getting a new brushes in it and a new cover because it's missing the cover. Yeah, but that's how you fix a cyber motor in your Roomba. So thank you for watching, bye.